As far as Dad's concerned, it's not the first time Belle's been drinking. Well, I told her to find a way of coping. I didn't mean getting wasted. Mm. All right, I'll have another word, sure. see if I can get through to her this time. I thought it was you. I'm back. Yeah, so I can see. I mean, why didn't anybody tell me? I'd spoil the surprise. I'll, uh, I'll get the bruise in, shall I? Right, and here's Nick, you'll be pleased to see me. No, yes. I, I mean, yes. Good. <laughs> I got you this. Oh. The woman at the shop says it's one of the best sellers. Oh, that's so sweet. You didn't have to. Well, <clears throat> seeing as I'm back out at lunch, there's one thing I've missed since I've been away. It's proper fish and chips. <coughs> and you, obviously. Well, seeing as you put it so nicely, how can I refuse? <coughs> Kane, I'm going, I'm going for lunch, love. You were uh, thinking of moving on? Why not? It's not like there's anything around here for me anymore, is there? Where's Belle? She's not done a bunk again. She's helping her dad knock out Hamish. I'm worried sick she's going to say something. Oh, don't be daft. She knows full well what that would do to him. And he's there saying he's always there for her, that she can talk to him about anything. I don't know. Maybe I, I should have told him. Maybe he's stronger than we thought. The only thing stopping Belle from confessing is the thought of what that might do to him. I hate lying to you, Dad. It's such a mess, I just don't know what to do for the best. Well, things will get easier. How? We can't carry on like this. Something's got to give. That Dom leaving. I saw him today. He's thinking of doing one. Well, thinking about doing something is a lot different from doing it. Yeah, but if we help him make up his mind... Oh, no. After all he's been through, I'm not having you chasing him out. No, I'm not saying that, but... you got to admit, things would be easier if he wasn't here. I'm not saying we force him, we just point him in the right direction. 